What is up, everybody? Yep. Welcome to Twin Turbo. Today, we are going to Cars and Coffee. I've never been to a Cars and Coffee before. I've seen them on, on YouTube. They seem pretty cool. This one is on the north side of Indianapolis, Fishers, Indiana. We'll probably see a bunch of sick cars, some Hellcats, but you know, I figured it might be a pretty cool video, so we will do that. Oh yeah, you can win a raffle, I guess, to have a complete professional car detail so that'd be sick if i won that supposed to be linking up with the bmw m3 competition we'll see how that goes busy guy just met him you know not gonna rush anything that's awesome that he said he's willing to make some content so we will see cracking so hard. Hear it? You got some pops and bangs going there, dude. Yeah. Have you dynoed it? What do you have done to it? Uh, it's probably pushing a little over 400. Wow. All wheel drive, right? Yeah. yeah. Do you have like a draggy or anything? Do you know what your 060 is? Uh, I think not. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that sounds cool, bro. I like it. All right. Well, guys, hopefully I could get a pole in here. This road kind of turns and it's busy out here in Mexico. So can't always, you know, get them all. But hey, that thing was popping and cracking like crazy, bro. And it's actually a pretty sick looking Golf R. So, I don't know. Twin turbo, baby, come on. But here's the thing. This is my jam right here, guys. This freaking Meyer gas station has E85, it's right down the road. The thing is, is that this E85 seems to be great quality so far. I have no issues with it, never had any issues with it. My car runs super strong here. Yeah, E85 is not everywhere. Even here in the great state of corn, Indiana, it's still harder to come by, which is why a lot of people don't like to run it. It is what it is. It definitely burns faster, it burns hotter, it burns cleaner. I mean, you guys know what E85 is. Do not watch my video and think that you can get a Kia Stinger and be like, oh, I could put E85 in it and then fill it up with E85. You're, you're screwed if you do that, so don't do that. Watch my other videos if you wanna know how I run E85 in this car. The door is open, I could walk right in. Ooh, but it's so much harder than it sounds. I know it's closing if I just stand still. Cause you won't wait forever, so just hit me up. It is not like I don't want you, just get to the track. Even if the odds are in my favor, I just need more time. So if you wait just a little bit longer, I will treat you right.
This is a, a Roush Mustang. Look at the details on here. Front quarter panel Roush. We got Roush on the wheels, center cap, Roush on the front splitter. Strut bars, branded Roush. Super sick. And the interior is on another level. Diamond quilted leather, Roush stitched. It's just beautiful, dude. All right, guys, so out of everything you've seen here today, what is your favorite so far? Comment down below. We have something special here. This is a uh, ZR1 Corvette Hennessy. It's tuned, obviously, but the lines on this, they just did such a great job on this body style. Uh, of course, this is a six speed manual. Here's what everyone's wanting. The LS9 supercharged, baby. Is that carbon fiber? Dude, this is an actual carbon fiber. Right? Oh my gosh, and it's clear. Yeah, the window. Carbon fiber. Got a custom MBRP exhaust here. Pretty hard. There goes Alex with the GT350. I got his number. We're gonna do some content. He said maybe. He said it's twin turbo GT350, bro. Man, what a great day today. Like, I am just meeting so many cool people around here in Indianapolis, man. Car enthusiast galore. Sometimes a car like that pulls up. When he pulled up, I was just like, what was that? I heard it coming. I heard the little whistle. I heard a, just a throaty, deep sounding V8, okay? Unmistakable firing order on those cars. You just, the Mustangs are so pronounced, they sound amazing. V8s are my favorite sounding engines. Oh, well, there's some V10s too, the Lexus LFA. But anyway, I was like, so what are you doing over there, man? You getting some E85? He's like, yep. And I was like, are you doing a mix? He's like, nope, I'm straight E85. I drive all the way out here just to fill it up. Dude, that thing is insane. Just alone being a GT350 is sick to me. Then he said it's, it's twin turbo. I wanna get as many twin turbo vehicles on this channel as possible because you know the stinger is cool and all and we're gonna build this car and it's gonna hang with a lot of stuff eventually but um man the gt350 though twin turbo Woo! all right guys so that's gonna do it for this one i appreciate everything smash the like button hit the subscribe we will catch you on the next one don't forget the m3 competition i'm working with this guy i am really wanting to do some content with him we are going to track this car we are going to do a dyno video we're gonna just keep doing videos so yeah don't miss out i'll catch you guys later peace